Welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me today today as it says in the title i'm going to be giving you some ideas i've come across through the years to store my ears i know a lot of people don't have as many ears when it comes to going to disney they'll have four or five and then that's it but if you're anyone like me and has over 80 odd pairs of ears you need somewhere to store them but you need to store them safely so this video is just going to be purely on how to store them not display them today because i want to do a different video on how i actually display some of my favorite ears but i do have a lot in storage and i wanted you i want to tell you some different ideas what i've come across throughout the years to really make them secure and safe but store them in a place where they're not everywhere and they're not getting in the way so i really really hope you enjoyed this video today if you have not yet seen my other uh, disney ear video what was all about traveling with your disney ears i will put that little tab just above and i'll put a little link in the description so you can go and check that one out that is to just to tell you how i actually travel with them and keeping them safe because if you have got some pair of ears and a lot of people have where sometimes it can cost them a lot of money for these ears and you don't want them getting destroyed or damaged or anything while you are going on your vacation and you're traveling there you don't want to get them damaged so that video is purely on how to keep them safe how to travel with them and some good uh, travel tips for you okay guys so the first couple of ideas i've got for you is actually purchasing something but wait to the end because i've got some really good ideas on how you can actually store them for practically free don't need any money at all to do it but i'm wanting to give you some storage ideas first on what i've actually purchased so if you would like to buy something to to, to store your ears then you can but i always want to have a cheap and alternative kind of storage method what won't cost you the earth and make it more easier for you so wait to the end guys because i've got a really good idea for you but the first thing i've actually purchased and i purchased it in the past week i think it was but it is this this was released from uh, shopdisney.com so this was a us brand i actually got it off truffle shuffle which actually they will import stuff from the out of countries and bring it to the uk but it didn't come cheap it was 139.99 which is extortionate but i had to have it i've been wanting it for the longest time i obviously couldn't get it when it come from uh, shopdisney.com but then when uh, double box toys got it in and just thought I've got to get it so as you can see you've got that design at the front which is just a pair of ears and then you've got a handle just there and you've actually got to put it over your shoulders as well you could easily use this as a backpack in the parks if you really really want to uh, but it is a storage method for ears especially so let me just open it up and show you what it's like inside if you're on my instagram as well uh, go and go and check me out on there i've actually put a video about this and putting the ears in and everyone absolutely loved it so as you can see that's what it's like inside there is five pair of ears in this and as you can see it's pretty full at five um if you've got flat ears you probably can double that amount but mine is all really puffy you've got your puffy bows and then at the top you've got some compartments so you can put watches or jewelry or anything you really want but they're really deep as well and you can fit quite a lot in there and then just here you've got a nice little mirror and then you can actually open that up and then you can put some watches in there or jewelry yet again it's completely up to you so let me just take the ears out and show you what it's like without the ears so that is what it's like without the ears it's nice and deep as you can see and i just love the red polka dots on it but yet again this is a pricey option to go for not everybody will be able to afford that amount of money for just to store your ears in 
but I just thought I would show you that way if you wanted to because I just love that. Okay guys, the next option is, and this one is very similar to the last one I showed you, but you can fit a little bit more in this one. So as you can see, it's a big deep box. I showed you this on the travel ear one. It is a travel box. You can put that over your suitcase uh, handle just there, but it is big, it is bulky, and it is extremely heavy. So maybe this wouldn't be fantastic to take on your travels but it could be a really good alternative to store your ears in when you're just at home to keep them safe so uh, let's open it up and show you what it's like this one was actually from etsy i will put a link below of where i've actually got it from it was i think it was around about 60 dollars because i had to get it from the us um i think it was another 40 about 40 dollars on top of that to actually get it to me so it wasn't a cheap option at all but as you can see you can fit quite a lot in it and it does keep them quite vertical as well so you've got some really removal of space and i've got one two three four five six seven eight pairs of ears in this so you can fit a little bit more than the last one i showed you but i think that's really good and then just at the top you have got a mirror and you've also got a bit here so you can put some pins if you're a pin collector. Me personally, I don't collect pins um, but I, I got those ages ago and I just really loved them so that's why I've got those ones but in, I don't really buy them anymore. It's not my thing but let me just take the ears out and show you what it's like without the ears. Okay guys, so as you can see, that is what, what it's like without the ears. So you can actually take this out and then put your ears on it. And then once you've arranged them, and then you could actually put them in if you wanted to. I just normally just put them in as it's in there. It's just a lot more easier for me. Uh, but definitely you'll be able to fit a good eight in this nice and big in storage. I just love the polka dots again. It's so me. And then on the side, just the you've got some pockets so you could put some uh drawery in there if you want to and you've got another pocket on the other side as well so you could easily put all your little bits and bobs if you want to in there as well as your ears and yeah i just thought that'd be a really good way to store your ears if you really want to and yeah i really like that one okay guys this is what you've all been waiting for how you can actually store your ears safely without them getting broke damaged or anything like that but without costing the earth as well so this is what i do right okay i've just stood up so i can show you properly but this is what i actually do to store my ears safely so this is just a standard small size suitcase you can obviously do this in a larger suitcase to put more ears um but i've done it this way to show you how i actually do it you can do the ears vertically or horizontally or like me what i've done you can easily do it that way as well but they keep it really safe and all it is <laughs> and all it is is toilet rolls so i've literally just put some toilet rolls from one side to the bottom and it takes five i think i've got five there so i've got five toilet rolls and toilet rolls don't cost much and you've probably got loads hanging around the house as well but easily i fit one two three four five six seven i've got seven on at the moment but if you did just straight down two lines so you'd need 10 toilet rolls you could double that so you could easily get about 20 in just a little suitcase but if you've got a big suitcase you could easily do the same effect but you need obviously more toilet rolls you could probably go straight across with a few lines so you could easily put them on there the reason i do it that this way is because it just keeps them upright they don't get squashed because you could easily put all your ears in the suitcase and shut and shut the case but then they'll start to get squashed they may get damaged just because they're all laid on top of each other but this way i find amazing you just you just don't need to have all that like worry of them being squashed or anything and it literally just shuts nicely and then you could easily if you don't use your ears very often you could put them in the loft or wherever you want to 
but yeah i just find that a really good way to store your ears okay guys i really really hope you like my little storage ideas as i've said with the first two they are on the pricey side and not a lot of people want to spend a lot of money on actually uh, buying anything to store your ears because sometimes it can be a little bit um pricey and we just don't want that so i thought by giving you another idea on how to store your ears may really help you to keep them safe but store them appropriately so you can wear them over and over again so guys can i give this opportunity to tell you a little bit about this channel if you really enjoyed this video and you would love some more tips and tricks about disney and if you'd like to see unboxings hauls disney hauls and all of that then please consider subscribing to my channel i love hearing from you and i love new followers and i love getting to know you guys so please leave me a comment below i'd love to get to know you and where you're from especially i love to find out where all of my followers are and yeah so guys like i said that's all i've got for you today and i'll see you in my next one bye